This morning, I'm here in Miami with Quincy AC, Epi Udo, and Dwayne Dedman. If you can't tell, they're basketball players. They're huge compared to me. And we're going offshore fishing for mahi and swordfish. Fish on Quincy's hooked up. He's gonna jump. He's gonna jump. Here we go. Here we go. Here he goes. Oh, oh, he's right there. There he is. Oh, oh he jumped off. No, he's still there. He's still there. Real, oh. real. There he is. Oh. oh, baby, we got him. Oh. Who's this one? Come over here. Come over here. Come over here. Come over here. Over here. Over here. Over here. There you go. You're good. You're good. You're good. You're good. You're good. I don't know. 50. It ain't always that easy. Here, here, put this in your hip. Right here, like this. Here, like that. There you go, like that. And you're just gonna go up and down and get a slope. Here, just keep it, keep that line tight. You gotta keep that line tight, all right? He's gonna jump right here. Here he is. There he is. This is boy, he's strong. There's another one with him. There's another one with him. Where? Where? Give me a bait. Here we go. Just, just take your time. Take your time with him, right? We got other fish now. We don't want to lose him. We want to get this fish in a nice photo. Hey, come, come over out. here, come over here. I feel like everything I just worked for just reeled back out. Don't worry, man, that's best fishing, dude. Yeah. On the way out to the mahi grounds, we saw a sailfish free jumping. Nick pulled the boat right up to it, we casted a pilchard at it, and in seconds we hooked it. It was insane. And there's another sailfish with it. We may hook another one right now. This is, a, this is by far the biggest fish of your life right yeah, here. Yeah, no question. I hooked the Stingy Ray when I was in uh, the Gulf of Mexico. But really? The line. There he is. Oh, yeah, baby. Hey, uh, uh. Are there sharks and sharks in the water? Oh yeah, dude. These sailfish, sometimes we have them get eaten by sharks. You'll see the, the shark come jumping out of the water. He'll try to eat it. So Bull I, sharks, I, mako's. You just let go of the line? That's no, that. man. You keep, you keep rolling. Keep fighting, man. Oh yeah. You gotta yeah. let it roll. It'll be your last fight. <laughs> Not me. <laughs> Not me. So when the leader comes up, I'm gonna grab it. Go real gentle and try and grab this fish by the bill. Okay. I want you to just be ready in case the fish takes off and I let go. All right. The fight's not over till I till I got a hold of the fish. All right. Are you tired, dude? Ah. You look like you're tired. You're sweating I'm like crazy. This is coming up. We'll get him. Well, here, you, the lower you hold the rod, the, the less it's gonna be. So you gotta you gotta stand up, dude. Hold the rod up high. Yeah. There you go. Follow him over here. He's gonna back, when he backs the boat up, that's when you can re, you can gain, gain line on him, right? There you go, yep. Just pull up slowly, yep. Remember, he's down deep. Nice. He's got that big sail, so he's like, it's like pulling up a piece of plywood sometimes, you know? A little faster. There you go. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. We're gonna get him right now, dude. We're, we got, he's done. This fish is done. He's just, he's just, he's down deep. Once we get him to the surface, it's over. Look, You're I'm literally done. pulling as hard as I can. Look. Yeah. You know, no, real, real down. Real, 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 yep. Like six feet, Don't let that fish beat you, dog. Here we go. You got, Quince, we got him, dude. Yeah, we Man, do it for everybody's Snapchat, bro. Come on, girl. Yeah, break out. I hope you don't jump into your left, real, real, real. He's, he's, he's ours, man. He's ours. He's not, not going to get away this time. Get on Q. Got him. Grab this bill. We got him. All right, here we go. We got him. Oh, Ready, good. boys? Yeah, yeah, burn it, burn it, burn it, burn it. Oh, oh, dang, baby. Josh, open, the the bell. Bell. Hey, man. open the bell, open the bell. Hey, man. Put the rod in. We ain't good tonight. Yeah. Yeah. Woo, buddy, oh. sailfish, baby. Look, he just had a baby. No, that's a remora. That's a remora. <laughs> Let's let him go. Let's let him go. Quincy, buddy, first sailfish ever. How'd Thanks, you like bro. that, man? I liked it, loved it. It was a fight. Dude, you were pretty tired. Yeah, I'm tired, man. I don't know if I got enough in me to fish, fish another one. Oh, Real yes, you do. Come on, you got it, bro. It's all about the heart, it's man. You want it, man. You want it. true, I'm a fighter. You're a fighter, right? Yes, sir, I'm a fighter. I like it, man. We're gonna get some more, dude. We're gonna get some mahi now. All right, but that's good that was, that was pretty sick, though. I wasn't expecting that. Me neither. I didn't really expect that you think of him? What'd you think of him free jumping, dude? That was crazy. I was scared of the little sword thing, though. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> You're scared of a sword? Yeah, man. When you get on the boat, you don't never know. Ah, he'll be good, man. He'll be yes, good. Sir, yes, sir. Let's get some mahi, dude. All right. We got three birds right here feeding. We're gonna pitch some live bait. See if there's some mahi underneath them. Ready? 
See him? See fish? Wait up. Watch back. We're at. Right to left. Pass. Nick, you see him? Oh, oh, I think he's on you. He's on me? Yeah, he's on you, I think. I don't think so, dude. It's all slack. Yeah, he's on. Here we go. Mahi on. Mahi on. Hey, try to help us. 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 Yo, get in there. There we go, another fish on. We're in the mahi. Wake everybody up inside. Wake everybody up inside. Oh, he's jumping. He's jumping. There's mahi up behind the boat. They're everywhere. There's mahi everywhere. Oh, he's jumping. He's jumping. Come on, y'all. Little mahi. mahi. Oh, he's jumping. All of us got. All of us got a fish hook. I caught some Z's. I caught. Hey, uh, Deadman. You want to catch fish? Hey, ready? Watch. Ready? No, come here, come here, baby. Woo. Oh, he got it. There you go. Fish on, Demon. Woo! Got you got it, got him. Yeah! Look how blue he is. Now watch, now watch, ready, watch. He's gonna change color while I'm holding him. Watch, he's blue right now. He's gonna turn, he's gonna turn green, watch. See how he's turning green? Look, 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 see how he's turning green? Look at that, isn't that cool? Woo! Got him? All right, that's enough. Y'all got three right there. Man. Well, you got a goldfish. This Amahi's gonna eat this in seconds, guys. Watch in seconds. Oh yeah, get in there. Get in there, boy. Get in there. That's my boy right there. You hear me? That's that good Mike. Oh. Quincy, keep your Woo. fish away from my fish, Woo. man. Yeah, I got the rod, I got the rod, yeah. Just uh, open the bail. Oh! Yeah. You want to get the release? It's okay, that's a good thing. On our way out to the swordfish grounds, we found some birds, and a lot of these mahi are here, but they're short. We're gonna probably move on here and look for some bigger fish. Yeah. Right. This is an eel. Swordfish will eat anything. You drop down uh, a squirrel, they'll eat it. I mean, anything. We're gonna attach two swordfish lights ahead of the bait. How One, far up you go? Uh, the first light I'll do 50, about 15 feet. Yep. And then the second light about another 25 feet up. And these that. are pressure sensitive lights, right? They activate with pressure, right? Uh, water. Water? Yeah. See so with my wet hands, the contacts uh, cause it to light up there. These lights can withstand enormous pressure because we would be dropping a bait all the way to the bottom in 1,800 feet of water. To attach the swordfish light to the line, we have a snap swivel and a bridle bin. What we'll do is we'll wrap the bridle bin around our main line about eight to 10 times, and then back onto the snap swivel, and then the snap swivel gets snapped around your main line. This way, we can reel the light all the way up to the tip. And pop it off. And pop it off, correct, and it'll just slide up our main line. This is our 10 pound stick lead. Attached to it, we have a long line clip. There's a spot on our main line that has a floss loop. It's where we'll attach it, about 100 feet from our bait. All right, we're ready to send our RJ Boyle rigged eel. We're gonna take a look and see how it swims, and we'll send it to the bottom. Swimming really nice. Yeah, that thing's dirty, man. Yeah, that bait's good to go. He's gonna eat it. All right, here we go. 1,800 feet, straight down. That's the wind down leader he's pulling off right now. And then we got all braid. You need the braid because there's so much current out here, you need to reduce the scope. If you use mono out here, you'll never get the bottom. You just keep pulling it off the bottom. And there we go. Was this 80 pound braid? Yeah. yeah. That's, bottom bottom. That's bottom. 2,200. 2,230. So right now we've hit bottom and we're coming up another 100 revolutions or so and then uh, we're gonna start jigging. It was a bill whack. It would be, that'd be unreal if it happened that fast, dude. There's no fish on there, dude. 
Now you want to drop back down? Drop, hit bottom? Yeah. Our guys are getting kind of hungry, so we're going to start heading back in. We got the big sail, we got some mahi. Unfortunately, no swordfish. This takes a lot of patience. You got to spend some, some time out here to get a big swordfish. But we'll be back out here again to do some more swordfish videos. We're going to head in, look for some more mahi, and then go back to the dock. Back here at the dock, we had a great day. Guys, tell us how it was. A lot of fun, man, time of my life. Big sailfish, we got some mahi. You guys cut your first fish ever, right? No. Not first fish ever? No, they've been slaying it for years. You've been slaying for years? So what was your first fish? Catfish. Catfish? Yeah, mine was a little crappie. A little crappie, how about you? Goldfish. You <laughs> where did you catch a goldfish at? Nah, 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 nah. <laughs> you you, you, you get a net and caught one out of, out of a fish tank? <laughs> Oh, no, seriously, goldfish, is that it? Catfish. Catfish? Catfish? Nice, so today was a big step up. Definitely a step up for these two guys. I'm the pro. You're the pro? I'm the pro. That's why you cut the biggest fish, right? I caught sharks before. Yeah, I, I catch them all. snapper, you know what I'm saying? Is that your first billfish today, though? That was definitely my first billfish. First, first billfish? Huh? We were, dude, we were looking for another one, another billfish, a swordfish, but that was, uh, was pretty boring. You guys yeah. even fell asleep while we were doing that. Yeah, it got a little hot out here. You know, I got drained from You the guys sun. were literally Bad passed man. out. All of you CSS. inside, completely yeah. passed out. Make sure you guys go and follow these guys on social media. Links are in the description. Also, big shout out to Wilmer Jackson from Spencer Sports Management for putting this all together. His links are also in the description. And huge shout out to Double Thread Charters for hooking us up with this awesome boat and the day of fishing. Make sure you guys go and follow them. If you want to book a trip, check them out. Hope you guys enjoyed this video and we'll see you next time. Black Tip H Fishing is brought to you by Shimano. Frog Tongs, designed for you, created for the outdoors. And Sudacore Nutrition.